hi everyone welcome back to my channel thank you so much for watching so today's video is going to be a vanity organization plus four tour today um so excuse the bare face i just came back from barcelona yesterday um so i'm quite tired and just could not be bothered to put on makeup for this video but it's okay sorry for the abrupt cutscene, but um i just didn't film the intro very well but this is my vanity and i placed it in front of my bed um if you remember my previous vanity was on the opposite side near my bedside table i will link the video if you would like to go see that um i absolutely love this one this one was kindly gifted to me by comfortablebeautify.com i will link it below so please do go check it out if you're interested i absolutely love the wood the rattan it did originally come with some rose gold knobs but i changed it into these lovely gold knobs that i had from amazon which was super cheap i absolutely love the rattan as well and the legs so it's i have this aldi stool and i don't know how i feel about it because the legs are basically the same um but i think it will do for now until i can find another one that looks better um but yeah so do let me know what you think let's get started so i'm just going to give it a basic clean before i go in and organize it so i'm just using like a basic kind of cleaner spray with a microfiber cloth and going into all the surfaces the drawers and also the inside of the drawers um because i just want to make sure everything's nice and fresh and clean for when i actually do organize it so this is the huge mess that i'm basically going to fit into my vanity so this is kind of like all my makeup and hair products and just basically everything i want to basically clean all my makeup clean everything wipe it down before putting it in so i do have these acrylic kind of organizers which i got from bnm it's an amazing deal i think it came with like a whole pack for three pounds and i've already put some bits in there to see what fits but i'm going to take everything out get everything wiped down chuck things away all that kind of stuff and then put it all back into the vanity so these are all the acrylic organizers i have they're all from bnm so i think in a packet it came with one two three and then like three of these mini ones so this was all a packet and it was only three pounds which is such a good deal because i think in other places you'd have to buy them individually and they could be like a pound each or more um so i have bought two of these so i've got some other ones left over from the previous time that i bought it um and this one is also really great i did crack it because it didn't fit into my previous dresser but um i'm just going to give all of these are wiped down and then organized now these are all cleaned and these are also stackable which is absolutely amazing i'm going to basically kind of see how it all fits into both of these drawers obviously it's probably not going to be perfect because i don't have enough and the actual acrylic containers might not actually even fit it all but i'm going to give it a go anyway i'm just attempting to see how many of the acrylic dividers actually fit into the drawers right now so i think this is the best way to do it so just have a play around with what actually works for the size of your drawers before actually committing and putting everything in otherwise it can be a bit frustrating and as you can see a lot of the small cubes didn't fit it was annoying but at the same time it's fine like it doesn't mean i need them all um so this is the other drawer and i'm just seeing if these will fit in there too and if i even need them i actually didn't end up using those three little cubes because nothing fit in them now i'm just basically kind of going through all my products that i have and binning them cleaning them wiping everything down and organizing them into makeup hair and jewelry Okay, so this is where we're at so i know it doesn't look super organized but it's organizing my head and it will obviously be organized when i actually put it in um so this is all majority of my makeup that has been wiped down and checked um these are eyelashes so i'm scissors also how cute are these scissors they're my favorite i got them from tk maxx i loved it because it was gold and it had acrylic candles um this bowl for like hair clips and random bits jewelry makeup brushes perfume tray and then this is hair and body and now i'm going to pop it into here and see if i can organize it well so here's a little time lapse of me putting the makeup into the organizer dividers and honestly i found this really really fun i know this is so sad but i absolutely love organizing and this just made me super happy um and also it's so satisfying when things actually fit perfectly into the dividers so after i finish this it's time to decorate 
Now time for the big reveal. Bum ba da bum bum ba. And this is the final look. Sorry, I know it's a bit annoying that the curtain's tucked into there, but that's the only way that I get good lighting. Um, so I'm just gonna go in depth of everything and how it looks now. Okay, so I'm going to go through all the details. So this mirror was from the Household Waste Centre um, where I used to live before. It was literally the biggest bargain find I've ever found in my life. Someone was throwing it away and I basically bought it for about £5. I get so many questions on it. It looks so expensive and like really vintage and I absolutely love it. This little mirror here is from Malaysia. My sister got it as a gift. Please ignore the mess on the bed. Um, but I feel like I need a little mirror so I can look a bit more closer when I do my makeup and it's so, so so handy uh, next I've got this little pot here from flying tiger this was I believe 50p on sale for I got a couple of years ago but I think they do have it back in stock but it's not on sale and I just put all my makeup brushes in here next is this little area so from the back this is a little vase um or vase sorry uh with pampas little pampas dried flowers in it this was a gift from my husband i absolutely love it then i have this little jewelry stand um it's absolutely beautiful it has a marble bottom and gold legs and i put my bracelets and watch on this side and then my necklaces on the other side this little tea light is from bnm i believe it's like a pound 50 and i just put like my hijab clips pins and all of that kind of stuff in there so it's easy to get and i can also just chuck it in there after i take it off this little thing i actually made out of clay um i wanted a little ring dish for ages and so i made this one out of clay and then i just painted it and put little polka dots using a q-tip and i actually love it i have like just basically all my rings in there that i take off quite easily next is this stand so i'm sure everyone recognizes it. this is just a normal stand from ikea i believe it's like a pound 50 and this one looks a lot nicer than like the pound stretcher ones um but yeah so so handy and it gives it a little bit of lift and adds more space to my vanity so if we go under here now this is a gold tray from primark it came in a set of two for 10 pounds I absolutely love it. It's so beautiful um, and it was such a bargain as well. Um, so I, on one side, I have all my little perfumes and on the other side, I have this little pot that I store my jewellery in. I believe this pot was from Paper Chase. I got it as a gift. Um, but yeah, so just all my extra jewellery in there that I don't wear as often, but it's still quite visible to me, so I don't forget about it. Now let's get into the drawers. This is the makeup side, so let's go in step by step so i organized the acrylic containers like this i popped some kind of like extra i had like an extra deodorant and like a makeup spray that i just put in the back so it didn't the acrylic dividers didn't move when i opened the drawer to keep the acrylic dividers uh, in place so you can just put a bit of like blue tack or anything and keep it down i just couldn't be bothered and i just found those and i thought it'd work um okay so right at the back i have a basically a pot of Nivea cream and then I have like some of my lashes and obviously I don't wear that much I don't wear makeup that often I used to quite a lot and I had a really huge collection but I've like really sized down now um so I just put my lashes here and then I've got this little egg um which I put my beauty blender and this was from Primark I believe um but it does get a little dirty but it's really cute then on this little side I have all my extra beauty blenders and then here, the biggest acrylic divider, I have all my face stuff. So foundation, professional, a concealer, a little bottle of water spray. Um, this is foundation. So it's basically this foundation that I put in a little tub to take to when I travel, basically. And also same when I put, use a little travel lotion pod as well. It's so much more better than actually carrying these. And then if we go on this side, so this is the longest divider. So here I have things that i don't use as often but i like it's there so i will remember to use it but i just don't use it as often and then i just have all my lip products 
after just like glossier little coconut balm um and these are my favorite lip liners from primark it's in the shade toffee i spoke about this in my makeup tutorial video i absolutely love them so if i do see them i stock up and they're just some um little like lip scrubs here as well and then here um so these are two little small click dividers so it was a little bit of a struggle to get this one in but this basically has like face powders and then this one has blusher and bronzer and then this last one is basically full of all of eye stuff so eyeliner mascara eyelash stuff um, i have quite a few mascaras um, but yeah just basically all to do with the eyebrows and eye makeup cool and as you can see it just fits so nicely nothing pokes out or anything and then if we move to this side okay so i have my that three divider right in the back so i will just move this just, just to show you better but so in one compartment i have these spoolies which basically i use to like brush up my eyebrows or my mascara and then i have these face shavers i absolutely love these so if you don't know about face shavers honestly i am never going back to like just uh, normal kind of hair removal cream or anything like that i absolutely love these so i have these and then i have two of the Tangle Teeth hair hairbrushes here with a random comb as well. And then here, if I'm just going to put this back. So I don't have that many products, so this is why literally everything fits into one. But at the bottom, I have things like dry shampoo, uh, hairspray, and like heat protectant spray. And then I have my deodorant. And I have this. I, leave th I want to leave this at the top because I absolutely love this. If you have really tangly hair, you have curly hair this literally just makes it so easy for you to brush out your hair i used to cry before because my knots were so bad and then i found this and i'm never going back to like uh, just brushing it normally so i cannot brush it without that anymore and then i have my big hair brush in here which is from primark i think it was like a pound 50 and it says a which i really really liked and then this is also another product that i really like using on my hair so it's the kira care uh, essential oil so after i brush it out with this product i'll just put a bit of oil in my hair to make it a bit more silky and then i have a coco chanel kind of deodorant and then just sunscreen and that's it so yeah obviously like i don't use that much products anymore so it's kind of small and compact but it's really really perfect for me and i just absolutely love it i'll show you here oh, yeah, and then this is basically the entire look so let me know what you think and if you like this organization video if you have any more tips um if you like my vanity please do like and subscribe and i hope you'll have a fantastic day thank you so much for watching bye